Hi friends, here is the second problem in section formula of coordinate geometry. The question is saying here, in what ratio does point uh, negative 4 comma 6 divide the line segment joining the points A uh, negative 6 comma 10 and B 3 comma negative 8, right? So we need to find out the ratio by which this point minus 4 comma 6 is dividing the line joining uh, the points A, B, right? So well, let me draw here a rough line. So well, this is point A and this is point B right so let me write the coordinate here that is minus 6 comma 10 and 3 comma negative 8 right so these are the two points joining line this is AB is the line now here is somewhere it may be somewhere like uh, suppose here that's P comma P uh, it's a point whose coordinate is minus 4 6 now this point is dividing this AB line in certain ratio but we don't know the ratio by which it is dividing this line right so let me suppose it is m1 in m1 ratio and m2 ratio it is dividing right so let's suppose this ratio so this is m1 part and this is m2 part now we need to find out the value of m1 and m2 right and we recently have learned a formula that's called section formula let me write here that if there is certain point uh, in a line right suppose somewhere anywhere and uh, whose uh, coordinate is suppose x y and the point is suppose the point is dividing the line in certain ratio suppose m1 and m2 then that point is given by the formula m1 x2 plus m2 x1 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right this is the x coordinate and the y coordinate is again m1 y2 plus m2 y1 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right this is the formula this is called section formula <coughs> I'm sorry now let me apply this formula for this point that is minus 4 comma 6 that is <coughs> I'm sorry that is minus 4 comma 6 m1 x2 so here m1 is not given m1 multiply x2 so x2 uh, let me suppose this is x2 y2 and this is x1 y1 so it is x2 that is 3 I'm supposing this as x2 y2 okay and this is this will be working as x1 y1 fine so m1 x2 that is 3 plus m2 x1 x1 is here negative 6 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right so m1 plus m2 again now for the y right for the y coordinate that is m1 times y2 that is negative 8 plus m2 times right m2 times y1 that is 10 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right so let me write it properly uh, it is minus 4 6 right and is equals to <coughs> I'm sorry actually I'm getting some cough <coughs> 3 m1 plus uh, sorry it will be negative right so plus minus uh, so when plus will one play minus it will be negative right negative 6 m2 whole divided by m1 plus m2 comma it will be minus 8 m1 then plus 10 m2 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right so uh, let me equate this x part and the y part one by one right uh, first let me equate x part because this minus 4 is equals to this 3 m1 minus 6 m2 whole divided m1 plus m2 right so let me first equate it okay uh, change the color that will be more better for, right so it is minus 4 is equals to 3 m1 minus 6 m2 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right so now minus 4 times m1 plus m2 right this will multiply this right since it is in division form when it will go uh, in the left side of the equal so it will be uh, multiplying this right so 3 m1 minus 6 m2 right so let me further write or minus 4 m1 again plus minus minus so therefore uh, therefore it will be minus 4 m2 is equals to 3 m1 minus 6 m2 right so now see here is also m1 and here is also m1 so let me uh, make one side this whole m1 and m2 in one side so let me write in left side all m1s and in right side 
all m2 so let me bring this m1 this side so it will be minus 4 m1 again since it is in plus form so it will, when it will come in the left side of the uh, equals to it will be negative so minus 3 m1 right here it is negative 6 m2 right and the, the this uh, 4 m2 is in negative form and when it will go this side it will be positive right that's why 4 m2 or minus 7 m1 is equals to plus minus minus and the sign will be always of greater one so plus minus minus it will be minus 2 m2 right so now uh, I'm just writing the alphabetical part in one side and numerical part into one side so let me bring this alpha alphabetical particle uh, alphabetical part this side so it will be m1 upon m2 right this will uh, come this side by division form right and since it is multiplying here it will be in division form here so minus 2 divided by minus 7 so now minus minus cancel out so it will be 2 upon 7 right so what we got the ratio that is m1 ratio m2 is equals to 2 ratio 7 right this is our required ratio but you know friends uh, we, we should not be sure still that the question is right right uh, I mean uh, question I mean the answer we got uh, means the ratio we got is exactly right because we need to verify it into the y part right now we'll be verifying with the y part with this y part right so let me do with the red color okay so let me write here y part y part is 6 equals to minus 8 m1 plus 10 m2 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right so let me uh, equate it 6 here we got the m1 and m2 right so m1 is here equals to 2 right and m2 is equals to 7 so minus 8 times m1 that is 2 plus 10 times 7 right this is m2 and again 2 plus 7 or 6 is equals to minus 8 into 2 it will be minus 16 <coughs> I'm sorry and 10 multiply 7 that will be 70 right whole divided by 7 plus 2 that will be 9 or 6 is equals to 70 minus 60 it will be how much right so let me do here you may be confusing uh, 16 so it's 10 10 minus 6 it will be yeah 4 and it will be now 6 only right so 6 minus 1 it will be 5 so it is 54 divided by 9 and we know 54 divided by 9 what is right exactly we know the table of uh, 6 that's why 6 is equals to 9 6 of 54 so 6 is equals to 6 means the y part is verified right since the y part is verified we must say that the, our required ratio is m1 ratio m2 is equals to 2 ratio 7 so we got the value of this ratio right this is 2 ratio 7 so like this we have to find out the required ratio in the question depending on the questions okay so in next video we'll be uh, doing uh, some more problem related to the section formula and different different types of problem and different different models of problem that will be really making you a uh, good concept in the section formula okay we'll be meeting in next video bye bye